everyone, and welcome once again to another edition of the Red Brennan Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins, along with Jennifer Brown Day. And Jennifer, a lot of times we'll start the show based on the seasons or the weather. Uh, but today we're going to do some houses a little further out. So let's start out by listing the four offices you all have, because a lot of people don't realize you guys are farther out than just one or two counties. We are. We actually have offices in four different counties. So we're in Lawrence County, Johnson, Floyd, and Pike. And then we, of course, cover all mm -hmm. of eastern Kentucky. So that takes in 16 to 25 counties, depending on how you uh, divide it up. So we can help anybody in any of those areas. And we'll always list the number and tell you which office for this particular listing. But if you always look at the left of your screen, all four mm -hmm. of offices uh, and phone numbers are listed. So make sure you tell your friends and family. Uh, and then if you're interested in any of these listings, we'll make sure you know how to get a hold of you guys. That would be great. Thank All you. Right. The first listing, let's let's do a few in Johnson County today because okay. we've, we've kind of talked about Pike for the last couple of shows. But mm -hmm. let's, let's focus on Johnson today. And this one is actually right in the middle of downtown Paintsville. It is. This one is right off Frank Street. And for those familiar with the Paintsville area, mm -hmm. that's very close to Euclid Avenue, which is also very close to our Paintsville office. It's about two streets over from your Paintsville office. And exactly. It's hard to describe Paintsville, but in the downtown area, I guess you could say this is the back side, right against the hill, not far from where you go to, like Depot or Route 40. Exactly, exactly, right off Route 40. And this house specifically has a lot of possibilities, depending on, you know, great location. And this one I'm excited to show because it could be single family, or this one has the possibility of being a duplex. So depending on what you're looking for, this one it could, could be, be right up your alley. Yeah, I mean, you can live in one part and mm -hmm. rent out the other. And anytime you can offset a mortgage payment with some income that that house generates, it goes up a few, few extra points. Exactly, exactly. So this is one that they definitely need to pay attention to. But it is 2,300 square feet total. Mm -hmm. And then it does have an additional 500 below grade square feet that's unfinished. Um, like I said, it could easily be made into a duplex. You do have a kitchen on the first floor and a kitchenette on the second. Right, and then it's also got a fenced-in backyard. Mm -hmm. So a lot of people, I'm sure, they ask you that when they're going to look at a house because they have small children or pets or whatever. So it's always great to say fenced-in yard. Yes, it has a fenced-in yard. And then this one has a lot of updates. So hopefully there wouldn't be a whole lot you have to do if you did want to keep it a single-family mm -hmm. home. So you have a new hot water boiler system. All the hardwood floors have been refinished, new roof, and then, like you said, the fenced-in yard. So you have a lot of amenities that go along with it. And this, this listing can go, like you said, so many different areas. Mm -hmm. If you want a larger house, if, you know, if you've got a family with teenagers or whatever, sometimes that little second kitchenette is a good option. Exactly, exactly. Or, like you said, you could have rental property in this house as well. So live in one part, rent out the other. Like I said, offset that mortgage payment with exactly. some income. Exactly. A lot of possibilities. And then, of course, I'm really excited for you to tell everybody the price on this one because everything that we just talked about, I think this price is going to get some attention. Yeah. I mean, everything we just talked about in this listing in downtown Paintsville, $95,000. So you don't ever, I want to say that big word, ever <laughs> see a listing like this with this much potential for under $100,000. Yeah, this is a great price for this listing. And this is one that I really recommend they call our Paintsville office to set up an appointment as soon as possible. All right, let's give that Paintsville number. Okay, that number is 606-789-8119. And this is Cindy Legg's listing. So when you call the Paintsville office, just ask for Cindy. All right, and also tell them 104-983. That's the number for this particular listing. And we'll go ahead and get your, your showing schedule. Sounds good. Okay, now let's stay in Paintsville, but mm -hmm. we, t we mentioned Route 40 on the last listing, and this one's out toward Route 40, toward the golf course. Toward the golf course. This is off Dogwood Lane, and this is a house that really, again, has a lot of possibilities. It's a larger home, about 2,500 square feet, has a nice large lot, a little less than a half acre that's very usable. They went ahead and did a screened-in porch. Mm -hmm. They've made use of their outdoor space with the deck, the fenced-in yard. So this is one, again, it would make a nice family home, or if you have extended family or anything like that, three bedroom, three bathrooms, perfect size for, for that. Yeah, and then, you, you know, all the extras in this one makes mm -hmm. it even more attractive. I mean, not many homes, you can say, has three fireplaces. Exactly. Including one in the master bedroom. So that gives you that 
that feel of going off on vacation. And then you also have one in the living room slash library and then one in the large family room. So you've got all those fireplaces which I don't have to mention also may help out a little bit on a heating bill come winter. That's true. And then it's it's near the golf course so it's out of downtown Paintsville area, mm -hmm. but it's in a country setting. And then it's got a lot of possibilities to add to it. They said that there is room that you could easily do another bedroom. So if you have mm -hmm. a larger family and you want four bedrooms, this is one that you don't want to mark off your list because you could easily have that fourth bedroom added. And then just like uh, we mentioned in the last listing, this one has a large uh, screened-in yard, screened-in porch, and a large fenced-in yard. yard. Absolutely. So you have that outdoor space, kids, pets, or if you just like to sit in the backyard and drink your coffee in the morning, great location. Okay. Now this one is also in the Paintsville office. So mm -hmm. uh, this was Kathy Brown's listing, but give the Paintsville office number. Okay. Um, that number is seven eight nine eight one one nine. Okay. The price on this one two forty nine nine. Uh, for this house on Dogwood Lane, just off of Route 40, Kathy Brown's listing. Give them mm -hmm. a call. When you do, uh, 105768 is that number for this particular listing. Okay, now another one in Paintsville or Johnson mm -hmm. County. This one's in Cross Creek, one of my favorite neighborhoods in the whole county. Yeah, I know you like this area just because it's close to the lake and all that. It's it's great location, very convenient, and then you also have all that recreation space out at Paintsville Lake. And, and then too, when we can tell you that a listing is on Cross Creek, in Cross Creek in Johnson County, I love it when we can say this one has the view of the creek behind it. It does. And this one does. It has a great view and they really maximize the ability to use the view. You've got two screened in porches, one off a lower level, a basement level, and then one off the main level that overlook the creek slash river. In case you're not familiar with where Cross Creek is, it's just off of, uh, I guess, Route 40 going toward the lake. Mm -hmm. So convenient, very convenient to US 23. It's just a couple miles off of the exit. And this is a nice size house. It's a ranch style house, but then like I said, it also has below grade finished basement area. The main house is three bedroom, three and a half bath. You've got one of those bathrooms down in the finished basement. You've got oversized bedrooms, a big great room with cathedral ceilings that I'm sure everybody can see in the pictures, and then a um, very clean white kitchen that has a good view as well. And this house, every picture shows how roomy it is and mm -hmm. how it just screams family mm -hmm. to me, family gatherings and get-togethers. You've got the large kitchen. I mean, I see these pictures and I picture Christmas and I picture Thanksgiving for some reason. Well, I was going to say it's a great layout for that because you have, you can see in the picture, the dining room opens up to the great room, the kitchen's right off that. So it is a very convenient house for entertaining or the holidays. It'd be a great one. And then you've got your 2,000, just over 2,000 square feet above grade, but you've got almost 1,300 square foot finished basement also. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. It'd make a great rec room. You could do another family room down there if you wanted to. Mm -hmm. You have endless possibilities what you wanted to do down there. All right, so if someone wants to schedule their showing for this house mm -hmm. um, in Cross Creek, Who's the realtor? Let's give some information. Okay, this uh, this house is listed by Teresa Preston out mm -hmm. of our Paintsville office, and I will give you her cell phone number. That number is 606-205-7890. Okay, the price on this one's 4099 so if you're looking for a house in this m price range, definitely one you need to schedule. Absolutely. All right, 106-506 is that MLS number. All right, now... A county that you guys cover that we don't get into very often is McGoffin County, and mm -hmm. our next listing is just outside of Salyersville. It is. This one's just outside of Salyersville. It's actually, if uh, you're familiar with where you kind of get on the Mountain Parkway, if you're coming from Pikeville or if you're coming from Paintsville, mm -hmm. you make that turn to go into uh, Salyersville, the straight stretch yes. through Salyersville. This one is going to be right off that straight stretch on the left, and it's on Dixie Avenue. I mean, and just looking at it, the pictures are great on this one because it's mm -hmm. showing how much yard space you actually have. You have nearly half an acre. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, half acre. And then you can also kind of see it in the pictures, but you've got over 6,000 square feet with this house. So this is a massive house that really can go many ways on, on what you wanted to do with usage. I think that the best way to describe this house is huge. You can say the house is huge, <laughs> the yard is huge, um, and then anytime you can say 
four bedrooms. That's nice. It shows you it's a large house. But when you can say you've got seven bathrooms, <laughs> now we don't mean all seven full baths, but there are seven, I guess you could say seven toilets in this house. So that just screams large family to me. It does. It really does. And this is the other thing that screams large family to me. I don't know why I put these two things together is the wraparound porch. This, uh -huh. this house has a wraparound porch. You can see it in the front picture really well. But I picture, you know, loads of rocking chairs sitting out and uh, everybody playing out in the yard. And you have great access into Paintsville, into Prestonsburg, into Pikeville from this location. And then, I mean, you're in Sagersville. So if you have anything in that area, mm -hmm. again, a great location because you're very centrally located. All right. Now, this listing is another one out of the Paintsville office. Mm -hmm. It is. This is another one of Teresa's listings, and I'll give that Paintsville number again. It's 606-789-8119. And for everything you're getting for this one, like you said, 6,000 square feet of living space, the price is, is very attractive uh, to a lot of people, and it's 309000 Yes. Great price on this house. All right. 106-209 is that listing number, so uh, give the Paintsville office a call, give Teresa a call, mm -hmm. and go ahead and get your showing schedule. All right. Now, we'll end the show with one of your listings. Yes. Uh, Finally to me. <laughs> there you go. Now, this one is in Floyd County. It's in Floyd County, and for those familiar with Floyd County, off of Daniels Creek. So, this right. the actual address is Holbrook Drive, but it's right off Daniels Creek in the Banner area. All right. Now, this was right off of US 23, mm -hmm. so it seems like the theme today has been convenience. Very true, very true. I didn't do that on purpose, but you're right. And this is one that's a new listing, which is why I wanted to include it today. Um, this is a great house. It is a four bedroom, two and a half bath, over 2,100 square feet, sits on a really nice fenced lot that they've mm -hmm. really made a good use. You have a really big uh, backyard with a deck and all that included. Um, and the thing that I really like about this one is they divided up the bedroom. So you've got the first floor master right. suite, and then you've got upstairs the three other bedrooms that are really nice size bedrooms. All of them have walk-in closets. And that's something you can't say very often yeah. is every single bedroom has a walk-in closet. Exactly. So they really make good use of all the space in this house. And they've done a lot of extras. Mm -hmm. I mean, you've got your hardwood flooring. They have went ahead and they added the crown molding. Everything is all in a nice package with this house, and they've, they've taken the extra steps to do some extra things. Exactly, exactly. And this is one that, if you're looking for something very convenient to 23, like you mentioned before, Pikeville, Prestonsburg, any of those areas, this is really a great location. A lot of the people in this area do the the drive one mm -hmm. way or the other or both if they have, you know, if their spouse is going different directions. And then one thing, if you've looked in this area previously, a lot of the houses were in the floodplain. Right. The maps recently changed. This house is no longer in the floodplain. So I think that's something very important for buyers to know. You know, and if you've been looking for a house for a while, and like Jennifer said, Something in the floodplain kind of knocked you out because mm -hmm. flood insurance, okay, there's no question, it's not cheap. Yeah, yeah. But now you can come back and revisit this area and this listing and not have to worry about budgeting in flood insurance. Exactly, exactly. So this is one I wanted to make sure and put out there for everybody to look at. Okay. Now this one's your listing mm -hmm. um, on Daniels Creek, so let's give your email and phone. Okay. 606-437-2333, and the email is jbrown at rbnw.com. All right, and the price on this one's 250000 so like I said, if this is your market, your price range, definitely give Jennifer for a call, shoot her an email, and you can get that listing scheduled. Absolutely. All right, well, we have covered a big part of the area outside Pike County today, mm -hmm. so, and then like I said, the four office numbers um, are on the left of the screen through any of the listings, so... Uh, let's go over your website real quick because okay. everything there, everything that we have here and everything else is listed on your website. Yes, it's www.rbnw.com. All right, now I'm going to step out and let Jennifer do her real estate minute. Today, let's discuss the benefits of a home warranty. Purchasing a home is one of the largest investments you'll ever make. To increase your confidence in this important decision, buyers should consider a home warranty. Benefits include additional peace of mind, reliable service, protection for years to come on major home systems, and hopefully assistance on replacing potentially costly items. Ask your realtor for information on a home warranty for your new home. Thank you for joining us for another episode of the Red, Brown & Williams Real Estate Show. 
We hope you will join us again soon.